Hey guys, what's up? It's Roosty and Sir Fred here, and we're gonna give you another tutorial. And actually, it's another tutorial for Overpock install. Um, there's been some comments on my initial Overpock install video that people can't get it to work. Either the launcher is giving them trouble, or they can't download uh, the mods, or the mods, you know, stall at download. So. I've also read about that issue in the uh, CCG forums, but yeah, everyone who has played Arma knows that there's uh, Arma has a way of wrecking your nerves, and there's always some weird issues that will affect you, get, affect you in a way that you can't even, <clears throat> you can't probably play, or you can't get Arma starting, or you can't get the mods working, but that should be like really familiar to all the people who play Arma but um, hopefully this works for you guys this one and if not uh, there's a link in the description of this video and I'll also put a link to the description of the initial Overpock install video and there's this uh, link to uh, Dropbox file uh, there's a guide made by CCG uh, which goes very thoroughly through the process of installing CCT launcher and what you need for it. So if everything else fails, uh, go check that post out and hopefully you guys be in the overpark in no time. But uh, let's go check out the uh, another way of installing overpark without the CCG launcher. So uh, first you need to open your browser and search for a3launcher.com which is kind of a short of, short thing for uh, Arma 3 Launcher and uh, it opens up this page and it kind of shows you the preview of the launcher and you just click the download and download the launcher, it shouldn't take too long, it's a pretty uh, small file <clears throat> and then you can uh, just uh, close the browser and I have already installed the launcher and here's the icon so we're gonna start it and it looks kinda like this it will start you know spamming ARM3 servers because this launcher also can be used to play other mods but what we wanna do is we're gonna go to the settings and see that your uh, folders are in, in check so mine my mods will go to my main armor folder and also uh, well, I use basically uh, for everything I just use the main armor folder and also you want to check or put all the launch stuff you have in your armor so if you launch overpock or any other mods through this launcher you get all the uh, stuff you want uh, how you want arm to be running so here's everything i have for mine so when you have that that set up should be good save it and um, we go back to this initial screen that shows us the servers and what you do is you just put ccg and it starts giving you CCC servers, servers, and here you can see, for instance, uh, Overpock number five uh, tuners. And let's just try this Altis one. Uh, in the server name or info section, you see the mods it requires. It requires mass weapons, Epoch, and Emod. So you need those to run the uh, overpark and here's this uh, play button. You press it and it will tell you that you are missing some mods which you like to download them. And I actually removed all my mods so I could show you this. So you just click OK on this one and you should be downloading the mods to the folder you specified in the uh, settings and also what you can do with this launcher is you can uh, put other mods 
also and run mods through this so there's different kinds um, there's also a possibility to run Battle Royale with this uh, or uh, well there's not, isn't actually any other versions oh breaking point you can run breaking point with this one too uh, the reason I sound so surprised because uh, I don't use this launcher myself I just tried that it works but uh, I use the uh, I go through armor to all my mods so and this also also advanced options where you can check your available mods and enable them in the uh, for the launcher but I just go through the process and I will show the turners because uh, this is something that has caused trouble with people trying to download this generous version of Overpock through the launcher because uh, it includes the all in armor terrain pack which is over 8 gigabytes so it's really big and it actually I think it, it includes all the armor 2 maps so it's it's huge and probably this is the better way to install this since it uses the torrent system so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click and it says missing mod you're missing some mods would you like to download them um, yeah so let's just put okay and we can go check the mods and it shows that it's downloading the terrain pack and since it's 8 gigabytes and also epoch is fairly large it's gonna take you anyhow uh, some amount of time to get this downloaded and also because it's using torrent system it needs people to actually share the terrain pack torrent so if any anyone is not sharing then you can't download it so keep that in mind uh, while you're installing with this Arma 3 launcher so it's uh, actually simultaneously downloading all the stuff I need for the uh, overpark to work so after you uh, done this you, you only basically have nothing else to do than wait because uh, once they are downloaded you can click the play button again and you will be able to join the servers so let's download the mods and see what happens so we've downloaded the mods and actually all we have left is to push the play button and see if the game starts um, you can't see me in game now because I'm recording my desktop so it it don't you won't start recording Arma but the game starts I mean usually if you don't have the mods in place it just tells you uh, the part of the mod is missing which we saw earlier on so I'm just gonna let that go there and hopefully you like this video hopefully it helped you to find an alternative way to install Overpock if the CCG launcher is not working for you and uh, if you have any uh, questions or uh, requests or something you can just put them in the uh, comment section of my videos and if you like my channel if you like my content please subscribe and put a like on any video you like it helps me a lot and keeps me making these tutorials and videos for you guys so uh, hopefully you enjoy Overpock as much as I do and uh, I'll see you next time.